Welcome back to Tainslade Info. We know that the United States has grounded the entire fleet of Boeing Chinook helicopters due to engine fire which broke on few helicopters. And we are not sure whether this happened during service or maintenance task or during real-time flying operation. To be more precise, as per the Wall Street Journal, the Chinook fleet of the United States Army has been grounded as it is suspected that some engine fires broke out on an unspecified number of helicopters. The same report said that while there have been no casualties because of these fires, yet a decision was taken to ground the entire fleet of Chinook helicopters as a precautionary measure. As per the same Wall Street Journal, the problem is not with the Boeing helicopters but according to them, the issue is with the engine manufactured by Honeywell International. According to the company sources, some components of the engine which is known as O-rings were not as per the design specifications. So what actually are these O-rings? An aircraft engine or helicopter engine manufacturer requires these O-rings seal for use in various locations within the transmission system. These O-rings are used to seal parts of the engine to prevent fuel leaks and the failure or malfunction of these parts can cause engine fire. According to Honeywell, they are not aware of the problematic O-rings and they don't have any idea on where they were manufactured and who installed them. The United States Army and Honeywell were able to validate that none of the problematic O-rings originated or were part of any Honeywell production or Honeywell overall engines. These Chinook helicopters have a problem with engine parts but both Boeing and Honeywell were not taking responsibility. According to me, this is something which needs to be investigated by everyone since the United States Army, Boeing and Honeywell have to work as a team to identify the root cause behind this issue to ensure other countries who operate these Chinook helicopters can continue flying them. Many new countries are also planning to procure these unique tandem rotor configuration helicopters but these types of sudden fuel leak issue and engine fire issues will cause concerns to them in procuring it. Coming to the Indian Air Force, who operate these Chinook helicopters manufactured by Boeing, should also ensure they run a thorough check on the engine parts and particularly the O-ring component to ensure these helicopters can continue flying without any issues. As the United States Army itself has mentioned that the problem was identified with few helicopters without revealing the actual number, Indian Air Force can coordinate with Boeing to see how we can handle this situation and take it forward. The Indian Air Force operates a fleet of 15 Chinook CH-47 helicopters and it has not grounded them as it awaits more updates from the United States. As per the comments from Boeing and Honeywell, those few Chinook choppers that underwent the engine overalls might have apparently been fitted with some new components or parts which ended up faulty. Even though these are my personal opinions and updates from various different sources, we need to wait and see what actual root cause is being identified by the United States Army, Boeing and Honeywell. I'll upload another video on the same topic once I get more updates. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to Tainslayer Info for more defense and aviation related updates. Thank you.